so cold uh, from the inside of the windows and the pets are freezing. cruising negative 40 and the biggest issue when you're dealing with extreme temperatures like this is when you stop and let the heat run if you're not plugged in you're gonna drain the battery while you're driving with your heat on though it's no problem because the heat pumps actually work really well um, the other thing is if you're trying to charge off a 110 uh, you'll either sustain the current rate you're at or you might just drop a percent or two overnight so you you're best to have a level 2 or you better have one close by if you're dealing with temperatures like this all right, so it's currently a uh, negative 38 outside. It hit negative 40. Uh, really cold out. When you try to charge off of 110, it basically uses uh, all of that just to keep the battery warm at negative 40 Celsius. So I had to come over and use a level two here. But the car's running great. All the door handles, headlights, everything's working good. Like. No flickers, no issues. This power steering is working good. All wheel drive is working good. Everything's working as it should. People out here, everybody's leaving their trucks running. And anybody that's going in and out. So it's nice to just be able to leave the climate control on. The biggest problem is, is how much power it uses when it's cold to warm the vehicle up. 